if you, and Michelle mentions Bloomberg, there are other terminals like that in capital markets. We've had them for a very long time. I still barely remember Quotron terminals. Wow, that's embarrassing. But um, the point is, is there, does this, ex or has this existed in insurance? And the answer is no. You can look at all of the statutory filings. Um, you can get service providers to send those to you. They even have financial models outside of the U.S. The problem is they're heterogeneous. So, and this is a kind of finance geek stuff here, so forgive me, but are we dividing the expense ratio by net premiums earned or net premiums written? Are we adding ancillary income to the loss ratio or not? Every European operating entity has a slightly different answer to that question. Certainly if you get into the MENA region or into Asia, it's a slightly different answer. So that's number one. And that's one of the first innovations that, that Michelle has created in Nova is that you've got uh, currently 160 trying to get to 200 plus perfectly homogenous financial models of Lloyd syndicates and insurers that are perfectly reconciled. So if you want to compare yourself, you know, what's the last five years of my loss ratio compared to everybody else and what's the volatility on the y-axis, you can compare it with the click of the button and be confident that the information are exactly right. And you can do that with so many metrics. I mean, there's 20 different metrics that Michelle has built in that you can do at your fingertips. So that's one big innovation. It's homogeneity of data. That's public data. Another huge innovation is price. You know, if if you want to know what the, um, to, you know, if you want to know what the uh, five one arm for Washington County, Utah is doing today, you can go on Bloomberg and find out what it's trading at right now. If you want to know what's happening in the marine hull market. Um, you can go down to the pub and talk to your mates. You can try to do a <laughs> renewal. You can try to place something, and then maybe you can kind of figure it out and triangulate. The, the, the second innovation, maybe this is the first innovation of Nova, is that we, are, we have historical data that's risk-adjusted for pricing for multiple different business lines. And Michelle can tell you the number of business lines. I think it's tens of business lines. But then every single uh, two weeks or every month, depending on the line of business, we're pulling in the MRC slips and we're automatically updating the price index, not every quarter, but more frequently. And that's that's an innovation as well. So if you want to compare, how's the aviation market in Europe doing, I don't know why you want to do this, compared to the DNO market, or yeah. how's aviation doing compared to marine in Russia-affected lines, mm -hmm. Russia-Ukraine-affected lines? You can do that now. And you can look at Howden's proprietary data for pricing, buyer behavior, and claims in addition to the full homogeneity of all those financial models, and it's in there. And to my knowledge, it's the only industry source that amalgamates all of that stuff, and it's always building. We're always building and improving and adding more.